Hi and welcome to this video tutorial on the Calculate Solar Radiation Solution. Calculate Solar Radiation can be used to calculate solar radiation maps for the wider community. And in addition, you can visualize the solar radiation on selected buildings in a 3D scene and evaluate the total solar radiation for selected roof area. In the Calculate Solar Radiation Raster task, you set the features that you want to participate in the analysis. This can be buildings, trees, or just the DTM or DSM. Set your solar raster cell size and select the months that you want to calculate a solar raster for. If you select all months, there will be also a solar radi uh, radiation raster calculated for the whole year. The resulting solar raster will show kilowatt hours per square meter per day, and the atmospheric parameters used in this analysis have been calibrated using the Surface Meteorology and Solar Energy Global Datasets by NASA. And this was done to provide more accurate results. Apply your symbology to the resulting raster so you can see the variation in solar radiation well. Now we can also show solar radiation values on the roofs of 3D buildings. You first select the buildings you wish to show solar radiation on and then run the Visualize Solar Radiation on Building Roofs task. Now note that selecting a lot of buildings will result in longer processing times and slower display frame rates. So you set the panel size and select the month that you've calculated the solar radiation raster for previously. And again, apply appropriate symbology. And in this case, make sure you set zero radiation to white because this represents the walls of the buildings. So there we have it, solar radiation values displayed on the roofs of the surrounding buildings. Now, of course, we can do the same for the proposed development. So we go back to our previous task and select as input buildings a proposed development. In this case, we take a smaller panel size of one meters and set the elevation units of the proposed development and select the month that we have a raster for. We run the tool and again we apply the symbology. And again here as well make sure you set zero radiation to white so you get nice white walls. Now finally, we can calculate total solar radiation on selected roof areas. So for this, we are going to run the Summarize Solar Radiation for Selected Roof Areas task. Now use the Selection tool to select a roof area. And then we can summarize all the values for that area. So as you can see, for the selected area, we have a total of more than 2200 kilowatt hours per day in August. So now we are ready to publish our solar radiation results. You can publish to Portal for ArcGIS or ArcGIS Online. And in this case, we'll publish to ArcGIS Online. Now the solar rasters, you should just publish as normal map tiles and the sonal panels will be published as scene layers. So first we create a scene layer package and then we're gonna share this package on ArcGIS Online. So enter a summary and enter some tags and hit run. Now this uploads your scene layer package to your ArcGIS online account. So let's have a look on ArcGIS online. 
there is our scene layer package if you click on it you can publish it to a scene layer and once that's done we can open it up in our scene viewer so this is an existing scene and we're going to search for our published solar radiation layer and then we display it in the scene and that's it you can add slides if you want and then save your scene thank you for watching